Warning. Censorship. Warning. Censorship. The CDC says lockdowns cost too much money, so maybe we should be putting people in camps instead. This is where we are. It was only a year ago that COVID isolation facilities were dangerous conspiracy theories. In fact, when member of provincial parliament Randy Hillier brought this up to Ontario politicians, he was laughed at. Where will these camps be built? How many people will be detained? And for what reasons, Question. for what reasons can people be kept in these isolation camps? Ha ha ha, preposterous. Of course he was reading from a government document though. It wasn't internment camps, but it was hotels rented by the government to forcibly confine its own citizens, often in terrible conditions. People were served food they're allergic to, women couldn't get tampons, others were kept longer than they were supposed to be kept without anyone telling them otherwise. And some women even claimed to have been sexually assaulted in those hotels. Oh, and some of them were owned by China, of course. With another round of lockdowns looming for U.S. citizens, the CDC, who now sees themselves as a governing body, and the Democrats agree, saw fit to recently release the following document. It's titled, Interim Operational Considerations for Implementing the Shielding Approach to Prevent COVID-19 Infections in Humanitarian Settings. What does this mean? Well, how about the first sentence? They tell you, quote, this document presents considerations from the perspective of the CDC for implementing the shielding approach in humanitarian settings as outlined in guidance documents focused on camps, displaced populations, and low resource settings, end quote. Did you hear that correctly? Yes, you did. A focus on- Hey guys, if we show you the rest of this video, we'll probably get kicked off of YouTube. So head over to Rumble or Odyssey to see the full uncensored video about the CDC. Thanks for watching another Rebel News segment. Please go to rebelinvestigates.com so we can continue getting you the stories you want to hear.